Finally got the got the X3 ride happening. I don't know how well you can see it. Got the phone light on. Doing a little day trip here. It's about two hours, two hours and 15 minutes each way. Uh, we'll jump over to the gas station, fuel this up, fuel the X3 up. Pick up my co-pilot. So he's on the trailer there at the gas station. He's right over there. And then we'll hit the road. It's, uh, it's about 5.30 a.m. Should be on the trail by 5.30, 6.30, 7.30. call it 8.30 should be riding. <laughs>
crawled it like a champ. right there big hole here no skid plate grabber you made it look easy Did you bought them out yeah that rock looks like it's grabbed with skid plate or two in this day
We can pull it, click it once, click it once. Don't matter me. Today's your trip. I said, anybody want to go? Tommy said, I'm in. I said, well, then you lead us, baby. for sure. I always lose when money's on it. This is rough. I don't know if I should have my seatbelt or not. I might want to bail out. Uh, yeah, I'd buckle up. Bail out. Uh, you don't want to bail out on this. That's a mess right here. I'll go first if you want me to. Let me look at it. I wouldn't hit it like that. Huh? I wouldn't hit it like that. At that point you were taking me down. Yeah, but you want to be straight on it. Yeah. You come down at an angle, it's going to roll you over. You going for it? I'm nervous standing here. I ain't going to lie to you. you I think we can make it, but we're a long ways from home if you don't. So we go around. Huh? I got one foot on the bracket. I mean, that, that 
baby's rough. Last time I came up to something like that and I was like, ah, oh, do I hit it? Do I not hit it? I said, ah, oh, let's hit it. I left my X3 in the woods overnight. I want to take it home with me today. Both of them in one piece, so. I'm going to skip over that one. Maybe come back with a group in case something happens. Got some help. It's definitely a good one. Side. There you go. There you go. 